For this demo, we'll be viewing the output of the VIA on the main screen, as well as a Windows computer and an Apple computer. Let's look at the default wallpaper of the VIA. On the wallpaper, you will find generic instructions on how to connect to the system. Also, in the bottom left-hand corner, you will find a room name and a room code specific to this particular VIA. You will need this name and code of the room when it comes time to connect. To connect to the VIA, you will need a client software. Let me show you how to download the client software for the first time on the Windows PC. The first step is being on the same network as the VIA. This can be done using a wired or wireless connection. Then you want to open any web browser. Type in the room name and you will go to the VIA's embedded web page. Click on the proper icon depending if you have a PC or a Mac and the app will automatically start downloading. After it's done downloading, drag the app somewhere familiar to you on your computer. I'll use the desktop. Now you have the app and will be able to connect to any VIA Connect or Collage system. Now let's connect this PC client to the VIA. Start by running the app. You will first be prompted for a room name. If you recall, you can find the room name on the desktop wallpaper of the VIA. Enter the room name and click Login. Next, you will be prompted to enter a nickname and a room code. The nickname can be any name used to describe your device. Like the room name, the room code can be found on the VIA wallpaper. You will notice that because the VIA knows you are trying to log in, it repeats the room code on the desktop. Enter the room code and now you should be logged into the VIA session. Now let's also connect the Mac into the VIA session. The VIA app already exists on my Mac, so I will just open it. Just like on the Windows machine, I enter the room name and the room code, and I have now joined the session. While only two clients are logged into the VIA now, the VIA can support a maximum of 255 users at the same time. Now that the client computers are connected, we are ready to interact with the VIA.